Hello, Collective, wherever you are. I hope you're somewhere safe, somewhere warm, surrounded by love, light, happiness, joy, abundance, and filled with so much faith. Real quick, and do me a favor, can you hit that like button, please? Please hit share if you like to share it, and please hit subscribe and turn that notification bell on to all so you can always be updated whenever I put another message out there for you guys. And if you like to donate, you do not have to, it's not a requirement, but I really, truly appreciate it. The info is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of, but with all of my heart, ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so, and to everybody who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, and for the super thanks and memberships and everything, thank you guys. I absolutely love you. So may God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. All right, so my bad. Today was my mom's birthday, so I went to her her grave um, and went and planted, you know, planted uh, beautiful little flowers for her and my Uncle John and my baby brother um, and put some candles up. Look at cute little, um, doesn't it look, it looks fake, but it's like, it's real. It's such a cute little plant I got, um, today. And it's so cute. It's real though. It looks fake. It looks like a little strawberry shortcake, but it's real. It's so cute. But anyway, but I got my mom, we got my mom, um, little lilies. It's so cute. I um, planted it, dude. The, their dirt there was so crazy like that's my uncle john's plant that we planted dude i could not get to freaking it was i broke the i was like broke the um thing there's my mom's plant that i planted for her it's so cute and it's a piece of lily but you can't really see it that good there's a little bit better picture but it's so cute but yeah dude i got like dirt under my nails i broke the freaking <laughs> Like, look at the shovel, because I was trying to, like, <laughs> the shovel, like, broke as all hell. <laughs> Shoes are all muddy and stuff, like, <laughs> whatever. Got dirt all over my fucking pants and stuff. But it was a good time. I was there for quite a few hours. So I had a good time. Um, and it looks good. I'm, I'm happy with the way it looks. And I got to spend some time with my, um, you know, my mama on her birthday. And my Uncle John and my baby brother who passed away. Let me just fix this. All right, guys. But now I'm back and I'm exhausted. So I'm going to do a reading for you. And I'm going to try and take a little nizzy nap afterwards. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and loved ones that passed away. What does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of at this time? Please and thank you. Ooh, you're manifesting something. Okay, whatever you're investing in is flourishing beautifully. The Magician. You're manifesting your ultimate wish fulfillment. <laughs> that's what you're manifesting. Your ultimate wish, with the ultimate wish fulfillment, whatever you're investing, absolutely beautiful. It's it's flourishing beautifully, and um, yeah, you're getting like the ultimate best possible, like your ultimate wish fulfillment out of whatever it is that you're investing in. Beautiful. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it, dude. I am so exhausted right now. I am ready for a nizzy nap. Someone's last name could be Nap, because right when I just said that, and I just like pictured I, there was someone's gravestone um, with the last name Nap, K N A P P. That's also a CEO's name. Officer Nap and in, in box, yeah, magician, Four of Pentacles. Um, somebody's holding on to something. They're trying to do some sort of magic or hold, or doing something to hold on to something that belongs to you. But it's ten ten. It's a completion end of a cycle for them holding on to that. Hmm. This could even be your ex, like trying to hold on, to, like trying to do some sort of like love spells or whatever. Come to me spells. They try to get you like to. Oh no, it's a generous blessing. Somebody's holding on to a generous blessing. It's a it's a lot of money. Whatever this is, like you're gonna be able to bless the pockets of other people. But we have ten ten here. It's a completion. It's the end of a cycle from them holding on to this. Fucking lose this confirmation. I need to move the wire to this microphone real quick. Holy oh, Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, loved ones that passed away. What does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of at this time? Please and thank you. Oh, wow, okay. You're protected. All right. This is the last one. So, dun, 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 dun. This is on the fence. Your bitch ass ex. Hmm. 
We have the lover's card on the fence. This could be your ex, possibly. Some sort of lies, betrayals, or a couple. Some sort of, or you could have some sort of hidden love. The one million percent ace of swords truth has come out about all the lies and betrayal. Okay, it's telling me to take, to take both sides of this. There's, um, why it's on the fence. Let me get the rest of the cards out first. Hold up, let me just see. And then we've got the Ace of Swords followed by the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse, the Three of Wands in the upright, followed by the Seven of Wands. Okay, so your ex, all the lies, betrayals, and manipulation, all the bullcrap that they did to you, or a couple, or whomever this is, the one million percent Ace of Swords truth has come out about this. Somebody lost a job, or offer, or um, they could have lost a lot of money. Something happened. Your ships are coming in. There's them strongly getting Somebody definitely lost a, a job with this Um it could be an ex of yours, um, or a couple, or something like that, that was coming up against you because of all the lies, betrayals, it's their karma. Your ships are coming in, and it's protected, you're protected. Also, okay, on the other side, there's, you have some sort of hidden love here. Or, like, maybe you got into, this is either you, or your ex is, like, in some sort of, like, they get, maybe they got caught cheating, too. Um, something like that. There's something here about some sort of, I don't know, something like that. Now, you, some of you, you could have came into union. You didn't tell nobody. You're keeping it secret. Somebody found out about this. Or you have some sort of hidden love. And, like, they, that's coming in. They're coming in. They're coming in. Okay, because the three ones, it is coming in. They got the truth. Somebody, um, your divine counterpart, I'm strongly getting... Or somebody just has a lot of love for you. They're hiding this. They haven't told you yet, but um, they don't. They probably I don't know if they they were lied to. I'm sure I'm getting they were lied to about you, possibly by your ex or or God only knows who. But they're hiding their feelings. They're they're hiding that they actually truly love you. They want to be with you. They now know the one million percent ace swords truth about you and who you are to them. So they're gonna come in with the one million percent ace swords truth. All right, um, um, it's coming in. They might have lost a job, or your ex could have lost a job, or something. They're not getting paid to do this, okay? This is actually one million. This is like your divine counterpart, all right? Your ships are coming in. They're coming in, and it's protected. Your union's protected, all right? Um, you might be keeping this hidden. Maybe you did come in, or like you are when you do keep. I don't know. Maybe there's something about keeping this hidden, or keeping something hidden about use coming into union or something maybe you're moving in silence or they're moving in silence coming into like to you there's something about their or they're just hiding their feelings they didn't tell you um how they felt yet but they're going to and they're going to come in with the one million percent answer is true they might even be trying to offer you flowers they might even come in or something like that i don't know somebody could have lost a job or they could have took it um um a hit like you know maybe maybe they're they're you know, ex, maybe they were married, maybe they were married and they got cheated on or whatever, or whatever the situation was, they split up, um, they could have been with a gold digger, a gold digger could have took a lot, so there could, there's something here about some sort of finances, either a loss of a job, this is either your divine counterpart, you, or your ex, or a couple, something like that, okay, but, so, but if this is your divine counterpart, if they lost a job, or something like that, or got, like, I don't know, it's like loss of income or something. Um, they're coming in. They might just need, they might be just working on their finances to be able to come in. But when they do come in, it's like, I feel like with the moon card here too, like you're not going to see it coming. All right. Like it's going to be like when you least expect it, you know what I mean? You're going to end. It's going to feel like, you know, I'm looking at this, like right here in the moon, it looks like a wand. I just noticed this. It looks like a, like, it's like a, you know, a little magical wand. You know what I mean? Like God is like divinely, it's not, they're not doing love spells on you. It's nothing like that. It's just going to be like, you're going to feel because it's your divine counterpart you know what i mean it's gonna you're gonna feel like overwhelmed like because they're coming in with one million percent truth and clarity they absolutely love you and they're gonna you know what i mean it's divinely orchestrated um it's like you're you know it's your other half it's the person that you deserve to be with you know what i mean the, that's not going to treat you like like these people from your past have um they're going to treat you the way that you treat people you know what i'm saying all right, but they're coming in, like, either you're not going to see this coming, like, they're just going to, like, just show up, or, you know, you're just going to end up running into each other, uh, no, it's, this is not a past person, okay, this is not a past person, okay, um, this is, like, your divine counterpart, right, and it's protected, and you're protected, and your whatever else you got going on is protected, too, beautiful, the hermit, 
they yeah they went inwards they seek they went in all right and they got the truth and clarity um, from god they found out who you are to them they're not questioning this anymore they're they're keeping it to themselves though which is actually a very good thing to do all right because you should always move in silence so nobody can go ahead and like you know stop you block you or try to mess it up um it's very important to do that you should just keep everything to yourself so no one can mess anything up for you i feel they probably learned that lesson already they probably could have like asked you know in the past maybe they wanted to come forward sooner but then they listened to other people and other people were just jealous because they either wanted to be with you or they wanted to be with your divine counterparts and they're like oh no collected like this made up all these bullshit lies um out of jealousy greed you know um and whatever bullshit envy and everything else you know what i mean so now they're they're deciding to keep this on on you know to themselves and just come forward so that nobody else can steal their blessings pretty much you know what i mean holy spirit divine spirit angels ancestors loved ones passed away what does the collective need to know what do they need to be aware of at this time please and thank you oh shit okay wow this is a lot of cards here wow all right somebody's running out of time oh i see ten pentacles in the reverse there's a lot of cards here I guess this one's probably last. Okay, if somebody's in grief, pain, sorry, agony, secretly, this could definitely be your bitch-ass ex or your bitch-ass karmic family or somebody lost, like, their family. We had ten sword, the ten of cups, I mean, in the reverse. This could be your karmic family because a woman for saying Ace of Sword Truth has come out and they're in deep emotional pain with the three, um, the three of swords here about losing a job or something or losing some sort of finances it's queen of pentacles in the reverse she's very cutthroat cold-hearted detached evil piece of crap oh yeah she'll do anything for money um it's like steal this inheritance or like you know they took a huge loss when i tell you maybe it's not her job that they lost it was a fucking possibly um an inheritance they lost because it was not theirs it was yours your bitch ass carmy um carmy your bitch ass carmy family and um your bitch ass ex that was working together or a couple that was working together secretly they were secretly working together your ex might have i feel like your ex for some for somebody out there all right now guys keep in mind this is a collective reading it's not a personal reading so take what resonates and what doesn't resonate it's fine don't don't get, like leave it for who it resonates for okay because it's not a personal reading but for somebody out there your ex is secretly coming forward with the truth about your karmic family because they know that they're under hot seat they know that the, the light's being shined on them see the sun being shined on them so they know and they're trying to get like the better deal or whatever so they're telling i feel like they're they this is either like fa like family or or people you consider to be family like it could be like a step parent or something like that or you know in-laws or something that stole that to try to attempt to steal this inheritance okay they they know secretly your ex knows that you're way too protected they know that like you know the time what was done in the dark is coming to light so i feel like your ex is now trying to very secretly come forward with the with a with the eight source truth to the justice system because they're in grief they're secretly also in grief pains or agony um and i don't know so i feel like they're definitely beefing with whoever this is that stole in your family that stole this either i feel like your ex feels like they were betrayed by your karmic family member they found out like the 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 karmic family member who's, who did this they played the f out of them all right and they're also this person's deep, deep emotional pain too that you want nothing to do with them no more all right because they did you way too dirty are you kidding me why would you want anything to do with this person anymore they were only there for money they were only there like they lied to you they betrayed you the whole effing time you did nothing but absolutely love this person with all your heart and soul and they did nothing but shit all over you steal from you hurt you and try to unalive you right idiots and now they found out that this family member who was paying your ex off to to you know to do whatever to you so they can steal this inheritance they found out that that this person who stole the inheritance okay that was paying them off in the beginning they begin with did them very dirty and was planning to set this person your ex up so they're secretly telling on them they're secretly telling them they're getting bad luck they're secretly going through bad luck and karma dude their grief pants are agony about this horrible we got the wheel of fortune in the reverse and a major backfire eight of wands in the reverse followed by the eight of pentacles in the reverse oh shit to the tower in the reverse 
idiots, idiots. Okay, so they not only took a huge fall, they're in complete ruin. Like I'm telling you, they're probably out on the streets. Okay, they they literally don't have like two pennies to rub together. They're done. It's either your karmic family or your ex or maybe both. I don't fucking know. But somebody's taking a huge, huge, huge with the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. This is all being done in secret. Right? They're not. It's all they're hiding this fact. All right, I'm throwing they could they they could be literally living on the streets, like literally not having. They don't know. They took complete ten of pentacles in the reverse. That's complete. Like they're broke, they're bankrupt. They're, if they had any jobs, they lost their jobs. If they had a business, they lost their business. Anyone, they're broke. They're completely broke. Um, somebody could have got robbed, or it was it was never their money to begin with. Okay, and they're getting bad. They're secretly getting very bad luck. Um, you know, bad luck and bad fortune. They're bad, bad karma. The wheel of fortune reverse is bad karma, and it's a backfire. Okay, they're um eight of wands in reverse. It's talking about a backfire from whatever lies that they told has come to light, and whatever they did to you is now backfiring on them. They're getting extremely bad karma. To the wheel of fortune followed by the eight of wands in reverse. The wheel of fortune in reverse. I'm sorry. The wheel of fortune in reverse followed by the eight of wands in reverse. This is a major bad. Like I'm talking extremely 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 bad backfire um somebody might not make it through this backfire like is that bad like this is extremely bad um followed by the eight pentacles in the reverse okay followed by the tower in the reverse so now the tower is talking about chaos destruction on people mayhem now the tower in the reverse is like total ruined like this is total ruin with the ten of pentacles in the reverse the wheel of fortune in the reverse followed by the eight of wands in the reverse this is like they're done they're done they're done like somebody is literally they're done they're either on the streets don't have not a penny they don't have but they're, they're they have nothing they're in complete and utter ruin their whole lives are falling apart you might not know about this because you probably cut these fucking spirits off like you should all right and the reason why this is happening is because they didn't we had the eight of cups look we have eight 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 look but there's also eight eight there's going someone's in prison somebody could be in jail right now and you might not even know about this that, that could be hidden too that the idiots are in jail somebody could be locked up or they're about to be and they fucking know it all right and um we have eight eight you know they're that's them getting locked up like some of them you know like <coughs> the handcuffs going on their fucking um on their wrist and it's also prosperity you know abundance prosperity for you my darling not for them now and it's because they didn't want to walk away they secretly your ex secretly didn't want to walk you know what didn't want you to walk away now that they're, they're secretly in grief pain or acne because you walked away now that they want to come in and somehow protect you but it's all for selfish reasons it's not because they actually told you like, whatever they're fucking losers all right they're they're doing it to really protect themselves is what it is they just know that you're way too protected and it's like that you know you don't realize what you have until it's gone and then when it's gone it's too late it's like that type of thing and but not only that they also found out that you know whoever this is either maybe their family or your family lied to them about you so now they feel like a total piece of shit for what they did to you because you know they were lied to about you um and they feel very betrayed so now they're secretly coming forward with a one million percent eight source truth um they're going to the justice system like they already did they already got just they they went to the just they, it's done these people are fucking done it's a wrap like <laughs> wrap it up <laughs> And like eight of pentacles in the reverse to like anything they're all they're they they're first of all they're lazy ass you know piece of crap this is why they could have lost their job too they lost a job because they're lazy they're not a hard worker they're not a hard worker at all they just want to you know they look at like you know what i mean the, the quick ways to get out they could be like that's the type of person that you know they'll be sitting down you know or or like falling asleep standing up and as soon as the as soon as like the the boss walks by all of a sudden they want to act like but they like you know they want to act like they're moving around and shit you know what i mean a horrible fucking lazy person sleeping on the job and everything else you know what i mean this person's losing their job or they did um and it's because they're lazy okay and whatever work whatever hard work they try to do to send to you is backfired okay backfired because they were very sloppy eight of pentacles and reverse is talking about real sloppiness and laziness too you know what i mean um they're done it's over for them they could have been lying saying that you know um i'm just, they're they're just they're upset they realize how sloppy they were what and not only the way like in their work or whatever they did you know they're idiots um but also like how sloppy they were with you they wish they never treated you the way they did but it's too late when i say it's too late it's too late like it's you will not take this person back and if you do um you will lose everything i'm telling you right now i don't think you're gonna have a chance to because this person's going to prison 
But if you were stupid enough to do that, which you're not stupid at all, so you're not going to do that. You're extremely intelligent. You're way too smart. You're way too powerful to ever allow this idiot to um, allow you, you know, um, to, to manipulate you to let them back in. So just be careful. They are coming in with 1 million percent answers truth to the authorities, but it's not, I don't know about you or not, it, but so don't, I don't care what they say, keep this person boxed, right? Because they're already going through the justice system or whatever. The, the 1 million percent answers or truth that's coming out about this, whether it's them telling them or, or what it is, but the justice system already knows. So do not allow this person back in your life because if you do, your good luck and fortune, you will have complete, like you'll be done. You'll lose everything. Because God's not going to bless you with it if you're just going to give it, you know, allow the, the people that try to unalive you and take it from you in the first place, you know, back in just to do it to you again. You see what I'm saying? But you're not going to. So we're not going to talk about that because you're way, you know, you're way too strong, way too powerful for that. All right. And I don't even think these idiots are going to even be allowed anywhere near your energy. Okay. They're going to be going to prison anyway, if they make it there. They're going to prison. Look, the chariot was speaking of. Oh, shit, definitely they're going to prison, or they are in prison. Somebody could have tried to run from the cops and got caught. The eight of cups in the reverse. They know they can't run from this justice. Maybe they tried to run from the cops and they got caught. You were, you might be finding out about a house. They could have raided a house and they tried to run or something. Your bitch-ass ex. <sighs> and they realize you're way too powerful. Some about a house here. The cops came to a house. Then I feel like somebody tried to run or they just knew that they couldn't outrun this. They had to tell, like, they, they knew they couldn't outrun this. They, they intuitively know, like, you know what I mean? Um, so they came forward. Maybe the authorities came to their house or something. Or this is your house that was, you know, actually your house that these scumbags were living in. Either your ex or your karmic-ass family. Look, just see how, but you see how that, the, ten of, the Ten of Cups in the reverse got pushed out the way? I wanted to go just point at it and then push it out the way. Like, yeah, they're getting pushed out of your fucking house, kicked out of your house. Because it's not their house, it's at your house. I'm strongly getting that. Or they're getting kicked out of their own home. They lost their own home because, you know, whatever this justice is. But yeah, somebody couldn't outrun. They know, they know that they can't, there's nowhere they can hide. They know they can't run from the police. They can't run from this justice. Maybe the, the authorities came to the house and, and got them. You might find out for somebody out there, you're going to find out either your ex or, or your family got locked up. Somebody in your family got locked up. Because a 1 million percent ace of swords truth has come out. There was some sort of hidden ace of swords truth that's came out about whatever this is. That backfired onto either your ex and or your karmic ass family. Noise. And it has to do with this inheritance. Which the house is part of that inheritance. I'm telling you right now. There might even be cars, stocks, and bonds were involved. You're going to get a message about this? Oh shit, okay. There's a lot. Okay, this deck really wants to talk, okay. This deck is ready to talk. You're going to get a message that somebody about with the one. You're going to get a message about the one million percent ace swords truth clarity when it comes to your family and or the, this ex of yours. Um, all right, hold on, let me just get these cards real quick. This, this on the fence. Well, let me just take it like this. It's more so this way, this way. Okay, you're going to get a message about this. <laughs> temperance in the reverse. Yeah, because they're a fucking demon. The million percent eight swords truth, how much fucking how evil they truly are. And how they tried to block you. Hold on, let's see. Damn, they lost everything, bro, when I tell you. They're... Damn. I don't even mean to live about this. You're going to get a message about some sort, somebody, you know, they might be trying, somebody might be trying to bind you or whatever. Um, the one main person answer the truth that's come out about how evil these people truly are, your karmic family and or your, your, your ex. You could have looked at them at one time, um, either people from your past, your karmic family, or your ex as like, you know, um, an angel or something at one point in time, or like somebody that was very close to you that you had a lot of love for. You've come to find out they're really a fucking demon, an angel, or like a fallen angel, or like a, literally like a fucking demon with the tempers card in the reverse. How they tried to block you. They're trying to block your work. They're trying to stop your, you know, your ships 
from coming in, but they can't in their deep emotional pain because all they did was block themselves and they're trying to block their finances. They ended up losing everything. The nine of pentacles in the reverse. They're not single self-sufficient independent. They're broke. They're completely broke. Nine of pentacles in the reverse over top of the ten of pentacles in the reverse. It's a completion. It's the end of a cycle. Because they were trying to block your finances, blocking your ships from coming in, it's not happening. So that's what they wished upon you. That's what's happening to them. And they can't outrun this. They intuitively know this. All right, they they intuitively know that it's a completion. It's the end of a cycle, and they're in grief, pain, sorrow, agony. All right, these these people from your grief, your yeah, your from your past, these people from your past, um, that work together with your karmic family and your ex. The one million percent ace towards truth has come out about how they sold some of them sold their souls to the devil how whatever cult coven secret society whatever they're in they're all going through horrible 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 bad luck and fortune and they did something online the wheel of fortune in reverse with a with a world card over top of this somebody from your past either your karmic family and or people from your past um they see you they're watching you have like a platform or like social media they see you getting all this like public recognition possibly even fame or like just you know whatever you're doing i feel like maybe you have a channel or something like you don't have to it could be just social media they see all the attention you get they don't like that all right they're getting bad luck because they're trying to fuck with you and whatever it is that you're doing um they didn't realize you're a whole earth angel this was hidden they didn't think that you're ever going to do whatever this is whatever you're you have like a platform I'm strongly getting that I'm strongly getting that Somebody I'm, I'm also getting that had a platform lost it because it wasn't theirs. They are making money somehow online off of your off of your back or something to do with the internet or or maybe it's that like live stream thing I was telling you about before. They're getting very bad luck for this bad luck, bad karma. It was a major backfire because something they did online. They're being very childish doing it. Oh, shit. Somebody's getting caught up with something. <sighs> something to do with children. That was very demonic. They're, they're caught. Either videotapes or something about black whips. Something about children. In a very dark energy. A very demonic and you know what I mean um there's either video cam there's either cam like videotapes that were discovered or something online that they were doing with children or is what I'm going to say okay it's fucking disgusting I'm not trying to tap into that um page of, of swords um they can't spy on you no more maybe because they're in jail and they're going through chaos and maybe they got kicked out of their house. They don't have, like, like I said, they're in complete ruin. So they can't even spy on you. They don't have no money. They don't have no finances. They don't have nothing. They've been blocked from spying on you. Maybe they're in either, maybe if they had any gifts, if they're like astral projecting or anything like that. Or if they had any like divination, they, they were unable to. They've been blocked from your energy completely. Um, and also, I'm like, I don't know whatever they, or maybe you moved from a house. They had cameras in your house or something. They can't. It's been blocked. They can't spy on you no more. They can't watch you no more. Ace of Pentacles. And they realize they walked away. They didn't want you to walk away from this Ace of Pentacles. This, see, so your ex, they, they worked with your, your karmic family and your, um, you know, people from your past to, to steal this inheritance from you. It was a lot of money. They didn't want to walk away. So they kept, that's why they kept doing you dirty. And now they're paying for their sins. Idiot. Someone's name could be Sin or Sin, Cynthia, Cindy, you know, something like that. Yeah, whatever you're doing, you know, you took a leap of faith, the new journey, you're in your purpose, you're doing God's work, whatever you're doing, it's going to bring you major abundance, or it is already, it could be something online, doesn't have to be, or maybe you travel around the world, but whatever it is, it's bringing you major abundance, maybe they got a message about that, or you're about to get some sort of hidden message about some sort of abundance that's coming your way. Because it's a completion, it's the end of a cycle, it's the end of a cycle from them holding on to what was not theirs in the first place. And everything that was done in the dark has come to light. Someone's name could be Rose. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, Love of the Past. Why? What does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware? Lil Lily could be somebody's name. They're the kind of flowers that we got um, a piece of Lily. That was what um, we got from our mom and my uncle's grave today. They planted it on their grave today with a piece of Lily. Um, and the red one from my, I don't remember, I forget what the red one was called from Uncle John. But that could be somebody's name. 
Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, and Ancestors, Bones have passed away. What does the collective need to know? Or what's the outcome? I'm sorry. What's the outcome of the situation? Please, thank you. Oh, wow. Damn, this, this deck really wants to talk today. This is the outcome, guys. There's a lot, man. A lot's coming out. They're not getting victory, success, public recognition, fame, none of that. And somebody wants to apologize now. Because they're a fucking loser because they're caught. And you have somebody coming in to protect you. Hold on, let me just see. Okay, five of pentacles. Somebody got kicked out. Your karmic family got kicked out of your house. And either your karmic family is people from your your past. They know it's the completion. It's the end of a cycle. The one million percent eighth sword truth has come out about whatever this is, what they stole from you, this house and everything else are getting kicked out or they got kicked out. All right. Um, six of swords you're moving forward you're going out of rough waters into smooth sailing they're trying to block this they're trying to block your forward movement they're they were watching you trying to do everything they could to stop or block it but they can't block it you know your ships are coming in you are moving forward eight of swords in the reverse um they were trying to get they, like they're trying to it's a completion to end of a cycle somebody was trying to get you locked up or whatever um have you bound that's not happening um somebody's getting out of prison or got out of prison it could be um a family member you're going to get a message that somebody got out of jail it could be um family or somebody you know from the past okay somebody's getting out you're gonna find out somebody got out of jail maybe they bailed got bailed out or bonded out or something like that or maybe they completed it maybe they completed their their um you know what i mean maybe they completed their sentence i don't know we over top of the world card they're talking hella shit about you. We had the Ten of Swords in the reverse. Um, it's a painful permanent ending to these idiots. They're trying to cause some sort of painful permanent ending to your forward movement, to you and whatever you got going on. But that's not happening. Somebody was trying to get you locked up. That's not happening. They were paying, you know, the, the truth has come about how they were paying people too. Um, and why they were trying to have you bound. And, and also someone's getting caught up with something, something really crazy. There's something about a videotape of tying somebody up. There's someone's getting caught about a, a body. All right. Or trying to trying to kidnap somebody and tying them up and it was caught on camera or oh shit they could have got away hopefully i pray to god they got away they're trying to make it a painful permanent ending to this person this could even be you maybe this happened to you or this is what they're planning for you but there is somebody that's getting caught up for tying somebody up um maybe the person hopefully the person's still okay um Maybe they thought they unalived them, but they didn't. And they thought that they got rid of this person, but this person was still alive. And came forward with one million percent answers or truth about what happened. It could be somebody from your past, I don't know. Or somebody's trying to, um, maybe, like, they know the truth about, like, a painful permanent ending, what these people are doing, and it's been eating them up. So they went, they secretly went to the authorities with, um, the one million percent answers or truth about this. These people are talking, these people from your past and your karmic family are talking so much, you know, ish about you and your forward movement, how you keep going, how your ships are coming in and everything else and how you keep escaping all their traps.